have some loans, but all oh, the places you will go. You may get one yes, but you'll get 10 no's, but all oh, the places you will go. It's gonna get rough, yes. even when you thought you don't had enough, but all oh, the places you will go. Stay focused, stay in God, stay in Christ, and most definitely stay in the church. Thank y'all so much. Too. Good, good afternoon, everyone. Good afternoon. Uh, Trying not to get emotional here. Um, that was my little sister. That was my wife. Uh, Deacon Mac is my father. This is, this is my mother. <laughs> um, this is my aunt Jerry called me and she uh, wanted me to say something here, so I uh, was honored to be asked. Uh, this was my grandmother's church. Um, that's how I remember it growing up. Uh, we would come in every Sunday. A lot of times I would spend a night over my girl's house because of her son. Uh, Derek's my cousin as well, and, and we were around the same age. Um, our grandmother would have us uh, wake up every Sunday morning early. We would go to the living room, and we would uh, get on the sofa. Everybody get on their knees, and we'd pray early in the morning, so I used to be so mad <laughs> for, for having to get up, you know, and go pray. And she would say, uh, uh, you know, this is just, you, it, it was just routine. It's just what, what, what we did every, every Sunday. We would leave there, come to church. I remember sitting in the back uh, with my cousins. We'd probably sit somewhere in that area um, <laughs> watching my grandmother and everybody in the choir stand. And, you know, sometimes we'd be back there giggling and <laughs> playing, um, Walking over to the little store over there, getting, yeah. getting candy. Yeah. Uh, uh, <laughs> just bring back great, great get memories. Um, you know, crazy. Um, I really want to say thank you to everybody here. Miss um, Johnson, uh, Miss Davis, even in the back, Miss Askew was telling the kids up here to sit down. <laughs> oh, stand up, up. y'all get up. And then, so we all stood up too. You know, <laughs> like, well, you know, I ain't gonna mess with Miss Askew this morning. <laughs> um, what I'm doing now, I, uh, you know, I moved to Atlanta after I graduated. I remember we had a program here, a graduation program. Stacy and Jeremy, I don't know. Uh, we had a graduation program here and, um, I remember saying that I, I couldn't wait to leave, you know what I mean? I can't wait to get out of here, and I, you know, I'll see y'all when I see y'all, you know, <laughs> kind of attitude. And I just really want to apologize, Mama, for even, <laughs> you know, even going there back then. You know. I left, moved to Atlanta, um, you know, went to school, uh, was kind of doing whatever. I thought I was going to DJ uh, for the radio station, so I do a lot of clubbing and, you know, definitely wasn't going to church, nothing like that. Um, but I always felt like, uh, Stop. you know, you just have a feeling something's watching over you. You have an angel. Um, there's a song, a Big Sean says in a rap song, he said he lost his grandma and uh, I gained an angel. Everything is a blessing depending on the angle. So I always think about that, that rap lyric and, uh, you know, everything can be a blessing depending on how you look at it. You know? so, um, Mount Vernon definitely was where I was uh, introduced to God, learned about Jesus, uh, took so many valuable life lessons. Um, I think of Miss Oliver, Miss Banks, uh, Miss Bell, like I said, my grandmother, uh, Aunt May. Uh, you know, they used to get sharp every Sunday, wake up, put on the finest clothes, and there were soldiers on the battlefield for God.